Hey, good morning. Um, I'm John um, Spencer. I go to Milan Free Methodist Church. Um, I've been going there for a number of years now, and like to say that people that go there and people that see that this um, that don't go there that it, it is an awesome church and I love it very much and the preaching is great there and um, the, um, this is um, an honor to be able to share with you today um, this this um, pandemic or whatever that word is is um, I'm driving us all crazy I know but you know what God's got this God's got it under control and um, we can make it through if we rely on him and put it all um, in the hands of Jesus. Um, okay. Um, God, only you can heal. I've seen you do it so many times all my life. Father, heal this world. Let this bring all of your creation to you, God. Father, we pray that ones that don't know you come to your feet and repent of their sins and give you their hearts and lives to you, Jesus. And ask you to come into their hearts. And, and if any of you need, need to uh, or want to, um, to do that, please let um, somebody in the church know. We want everybody in heaven with Jesus one day. Um, and you know, everybody has an opportunity to um, give their lives to Jesus. No matter what you have done in this life, no, no matter um, how bad you think you are or um, you've done, um, it, it can, it's, it's all can be forgiven if you ask if you ask him to forgive you. John 3:16. For God so loved the world, the whole world, everybody. He 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 loves us. He he died on the cross for you and me. Um, so loved the world that he gave his one and only son. God gave his son Jesus on the cross for you and me, and he loves each and every one of us, so that whosoever believes in him will not perish, but have eternal life. He, he doesn't want us to die without him in our hearts. Give your hearts to Jesus and be in heaven. And when you're in heaven, um, we're going to be praising Jesus for eternity and um, walking on streets of gold. And um, I can't wait to be able to run on, on, in heaven. Get rid of this walker that I use. I, and race um, my old pastor, Pastor John, um, up there. I, and I'm gonna love it. And I want you to enjoy it too. Um, please give your hearts to Jesus. And um, Romans 3.23, um, for I'll fall short of the glory of God. Um, 
we we all fall short um, of the God's glory. We all fall short of Him. We we need to um, just come to Him. So Romans six twenty three. Um, for the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Um, you know, and for everything we do, I mean, that's a sin, you know. You know, it leads to death. It leads to a life of um, uh, you, you know, of destruction, of pain, of sorrow, um, of distress, and away, being away from God, um, and all sorts of things. But, um, you know, we can come back to God. We can, we can give him our hearts and our lives and have eternal life. Um, and we just got to ask Jesus into our hearts and lives. Um, and please do that today if you have not. It is so important, so important. Um, if you you know me, and if you have me on Facebook, I am always, always telling people about Jesus. I am always preaching Jesus and um, telling people about Jesus. And that's my passion, and that's what Jesus called me to do and so I'm going to do it and um, I hope you all are surviving during this and I hope you guys all come to bite to church or, or to church if you don't come to church when when this um, thing is over um, because it's going to be a great, great day when we can all get together again. And it's going to be a great, great day in heaven um, when we get to the same before Jesus and bow at his feet and um, no more no more pain, no more sorrows um, of anything. And... I can't wait for that. I can't wait. I can't wait to throw my walker away. I can't wait to just be in the presence of God and fall at his feet. And, you know, it's just going to be a wonderful day. And, um, all right, I will talk to you all later and have a blessed day.